mixed reactions as Yol Edochi posts lovely photos of his first wife, May Edochi. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. Just recently, Nollywood actor Yol Edochi stirred mixed reactions after sharing a lovely photo of his first wife, May Yol Edochi, via his official Instagram handle. Captioning the photos of his first wife, Yol Edochi wrote number one. May Yule Doche undisputed. Minutes after posting the lovely photos of his first wife, thousands of reactions flooded the comment section. Reacting to the photo shared, many criticized Yule Doche heavily. Because if you can recall, hours before the photos were shared, Yule Doche announced that he had welcomed a son with his second wife, Judy Austin, and this did not stand well with some people. However, despite the criticism, some commented on how lovely Yule Doche's first wife looked in the photos that were shared via his Instagram handle. Below are some reactions to the photos of Yul Edoche's first wife. A, to a social media user opined, I don't see anything wrong in what he did. Marrying a second wife, especially in Igbo land, is not a taboo. It only becomes a problem when you don't consult your first wife. To seek for consent and even when she refuses to let you go ahead with her plans that doesn't mean he committed any crime by marrying as many wives as he desires you don't just come here to condemn him because you feel he's doing something bad or is it against the Igbo tradition never so what makes you happy that's the rule of life you did absolutely nothing wrong life is not that hard wow okay May peace and harmony reign in your home. Having two wives is not a crime. Our forefathers knew how to balance the equation. Be of good courage. The most important thing is to accept responsibility. Okay. Another pin. Last, last, the second wife and baby could be movie set. <laughs> Another commented, if she was, you will never hurt her. Another opined, you guys always play with the emotions of the ones that love you, but I promise it will not end well. Another opined, I still, I can't still believe this. I think it's a prank. Another opined, you, I swear, I, I, <laughs> I hate you. Okay, I hate you, and I'm really disappointed with you. I better get out. <laughs> Another opined, good morning, sir. Did you serve breakfast and stay calm and say number one? Another pinned, Oga, Piko, go and rest and leave this woman in peace. Wow. No really good Christian will keep two wives. Two wives. Onto this matter, a lot of people are coming out to give the opinion. Some are saying it is wrong, some are saying it is right, some are saying it is men are polygamous in nature. While some are saying there is absolutely nothing wrong because it's actually a tradition. While in my opinion, I was, I was, I was like, okay, fine. I don't. Before I say it is right or wrong, that this man informed the wife when they were going to get married that he was going to take a second wife. This thing to be based on agreement. You don't come halfway to tell me I'll start um, sharing my home with another. No, it's not done. It's not done. For those who come and say, oh, our forefathers married, our forefathers, they knew. Would it be mine and other wife? Of course they knew. They get to know. They get to know before it happened, so it's not always much of a problem. And you cannot compare them to now. A lot of things have changed. People have moved on from the analog age to the digital age. She is more beautiful. Drinking panado for another person's head. The first wife is not complaining. People are busy putting fire on social media. My dear, this matter tire me. The matter tire me, you, my dear. The matter tire me. Well, well. I mean, I'm saying we have a lot of issues in on our hands in Nigeria here to talk about, and we're busy talking about this particular one. It is their life. Both people involved are adults. There's the child there, but people involved, those who are taking the decisions are adults, and they also know the consequences of any action they take. Damage control, but will it work? This man just wants to destroy his family. Second, second wife, no good. Okay.
damage control emotion exactly in my opinion Yule Duchi he made a mistake and to him the best way to correct the mistake is by taking responsibility of the mistake not leaving the lady in question and also you know and not leaving the lady in question and not taking responsibility is a way of you know not manning up in his own mind manning up is let me marry this lady and let me make her my wife so that the wife and my child would be legitimate okay then the second wife around us holy ghost fire there is harm is to their, their aim is to come and reap where they did not so scatter home and go away because they don't love they don't usually last their mission is to come and scatter what you suffered for if only the first wife can have patience and stay in the marriage she will testify later hmm. okay what a shame you're you're digging your grave how many wife did your daddy marry you're ungrateful to god you don't kiss month to month in your films i don't know you're a deceiver with wicked heart with a beautiful my wife me anyways you regret this and that and tell that your husband snatch another person will do her back what she did to me wicked people <laughs> look at people drinking seriously going to the hospital not even drinking panadol this one is going to the hospital to ask for bed and for asking and tell them to give you drip for sickness when you do your body hmm. okay it is better not to love a man just like so so you will not be hurt when they when they disappoint you i don't totally blame you some desperate women will use anything especially the use of love potion to get a man they want this lady already has two children for different men you can just imagine that only god now you know sincerely i don't know about this one only god now you know well like i've said that before we have a lot of issues on ground in nigeria in fact this moment is wrong timing wrong timing for this issue to come out because we have a lot and this issue just the distract us from the main issue which is there is a security in the land there is economical decay there is inflation, the price of things keep going on, on and on. There is a what's it called insecurity in almost all the geopolitical zones. And of course, all that matters to our politicians now in all of this is elections. And even we the electorate, we have been carried